Hello, my darlings. It's Dion Dean here. We are in my office, just in another portion of my office. I wish I could show you the other side, but I will not. Um, as you guys know, I am, well, may not know, I am now 34 weeks pregnant. We are almost there, honey. Riley is almost ready to pop. And so we are rearranging some things in my office. And so you probably won't see my other setup for a minute. But I did a major haul this week um, as I prepared to just load up my eBay store um, for September, October, November, um, since I probably won't be able to get into the stores as much. Um, so I just went and just did a huge haul of stuff to put into my eBay store. So I want to share that with you before I put everything up this afternoon. So you ready? Ready to go? Let's go. Um, so remember my last video I was talking about just feeling, or I think one or two videos ago, I have just really been wanting to, um, I don't know, I just really been wanting to like do Goodwills and like upscale resales um, and to shop at places where I know that my money is working. And so today I did a huge, well, between yesterday and today, I went to two different Goodwills and found a bunch of stuff. As you can see from these huge bags, woo! And, you know, I always go in for my eBay store, but it ends up being half for me, half for my eBay store. And if I don't, I'm not feeling it, then it goes in my eBay store. But let's start with shoes, okay? And once again, you see, well, this is like part of my shoes. As you can see, a lot of them are heels. And my husband's like, I don't know where you think you're going because you're not wearing them heels. And then I went to Goodwill and what did I pick up? More heels. So these will probably be on my eBay store. <laughs> um, these are a pair of Michael Kors dress pumps. And these are in a 10. So these won't go in my store. But I thought these were so cute. And once again, I'm always like wondering who is just donating stuff and not putting them on consignment. Because if I, if I have a pair of Michael Kors shoes, I'm putting them on consignment. Like, I'm not just putting them in a Goodwill bag, but regardless. So here are some Michael Kors shoes that I picked up um, at the Goodwill. And they're in pretty good condition, right? And when we talked about how to thrift a good shoe, as you can see, like the 10 is stamped in there. So this will go in the store. I thought these were really, really cute. Do, 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 especially for the working girl, especially for fall. It's like a suede material and it has like the snake skin. So that's one pair. And then these I got for myself. <laughs> Where am I going in these? Nine months, eight months pregnant. But I was like, whatever, I'll wear them in the fall. I love a patent shoe, y'all. Y'all already know. And these are from Aldo. And they're like in really, really good condition. And as you can see, like, right, can you see? I'll do it in the camera. All these patent leather shoes, all these black shoes. I love patent shoes. I'm just addicted. And so I couldn't stop myself. <laughs> so these are like, and they, they're they worn on the bottom a little bit, but not that much. You can still see the size. Can you see it? Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. You can see the size there, 40, which is like a nine and a half. But for fall, I'm going to rock these or put them on eBay. I don't know. So it's in really good condition. So that's that. And then I got these. Ken is called Reaction. Oh my God, I fell in love with these. I hope these come up on camera as, as beautiful as they are in person. Can you see that? So they're like faux, no, they're suede, not faux suede. They're suede and then they have like this grip bottom. So nice. And then they have this leather detail on the back. Isn't that gorgeous? I was like, I'm praying that these fit. And they do. I'm an eight and a half, nine. And my feet have swollen a little bit. But I'm going to get back into my eight and a half, nine. So I'm not going to have no swollen feet. But <laughs> so there's that. And these were like barely, I don't even think they, they haven't been worn. These were at, they have like the DSW sticker. Do you see that? And it says that. They were $89 and then $69.94. And I got these at Goodwill for $3.99. So, yeah, that was a good purchase. This was like 
the purchase of the day. All right. And then these. I know I'm not going anywhere in these, honey. I know for a fact. But these are so hot. Somebody on my eBay store is going to want these. Look at these. Oh, my gosh. For a holiday party? Yes, God. You see these? And these are by Cupid. Just kind of like, I guess like a Charlotte Russe type of brand. But they're so well made. And you guys know I like a quality shoe. These are really, really well made. And we, remember we talked about the sticker on my Had a Thrift of Quality shoe. And this one has a sticker, not a stamp. But it is so beautiful. Look at that. Barely worn. What is it with me in a heel? I thrifted no flats. That is so crazy to me. All right. So that's it for shoes. And then let's go to handbags. I'm going to show you. I did so great in handbags. I've been having such great luck with handbags lately. It's not even funny. Am I zoomed in? Okay. <laughs> it looks a little fuzzy for a little bit. Okay. So next is handbags. So I have a vintage handbag thing going on. I've had it forever because I don't like to see people in my stuff. And so I feel like the only way that they're not going to see see my stuff or see anybody in my stuff is for it to be vintage. So I got this beautiful purse. Beautiful vintage purse. And it's a little big. Because I like big purses, especially when you're not on the town. So this I would wear with like a jean jacket and like a white top. No, not even a jean jacket, like a black blazer, a white like gap tee and a pair of destructive jeans and like a killer heel like this, like a boyfriend jean, these shoes, white gap tee, gap, uh, black blazer and this killing it or every time killing it. So that's that. It's like a mesh kind of thing, but it's so beautiful. So that's that. And then this, I don't know if I'm, I just liked it. I don't even know what I'm going to do with it. I was going to put it in my, I probably will put it in my store, but I don't know. I just liked it. It was funky. Look at that. I like clutches, by the way, if you have not noticed by now. And so I just felt like, look at that. That's so cute. Once again, if you wear like an all black dress like I have on right now, and you're just like running to the store, this is cute. Look at me running to the store in a red and gold, in a red and gold, red and gold clutch. But that's who I am. Oh, as much as my pillows. So that's that. And then this Sharif, if you are a vintage lover, then you know about Sharif handbags. And I try to pick them up and put them in my eBay store whenever I can. So I found the Sharif bag. It's a crossbody bag. And it has tassels. You guys know I love tassels from my DC video. It's pretty good on the inside, right? It's got like three compartments. Oh, got like three compartments. So I may wear this for a few seasons and then put it in my eBay store. And then last but not least, once again, I don't know who... Is sitting on money like that, that they can just donate bags and not consign them. And it may not be a money thing. It may just be not having the time or the wherewithal or just not knowing that the, something they can do to just take something to like a closed mentor or um, any of the consignment uh, stores that we have around the country. I found this authentic Kate Spade bag. Isn't that gorgeous? So that will be going on eBay. Absolutely. So that's going on eBay. And I actually, I'm putting together eBay, um, how to sell on eBay course for all of my fans and friends and just for people who have been asking, like, or they're interested in going and doing an eBay store, whether it's thrift or um, 
they just have different hobbies and stuff like that and they want to sell on eBay or Etsy and putting together a course and so this was one of the items that I actually featured in my course on how to price your items so that's if you're interested I'll leave the link below for the eBay course because I use this as an example of you know how to research what to sell your items for so stay tuned because that was a really good it's a really good e-course um, so that's good for that then jewelry Goodwill got all my money, child. But it's for a good cause. So let's see. Okay. Let's do one at a time. So this bracelet is stunning. Especially for like the holidays are coming up. So this was $3.99. This is not for the store. The jewelry is for me. I couldn't resist looking at the jewelry counter. That's for me. Quickly, I got this piece, and this is this is a Napier piece, so it's a really good piece. So there's that. And with my jewelry, with anything that's on my wrist, I actually like to double up. So this is, I'll probably just wear this with a watch. $3.99. And this, I mean, who doesn't want a chunky silver bracelet? I was like, yes, give me that. $3.99. And as you know, most of my jewelry is thrifted. Beautiful piece. And it's very weighty. All of these are very weighty. When I'm when I um when I thrift jewelry, like I can't do tchotchke jewelry. I can't do, like, jewelry that's not going to last. It has to be real gold, real silver, and very weighty. It has to be, like, the good stuff. So that's why, for me, thrifting works. Because if I were to go to Macy's or um, Saks or Neiman's or wherever, whatever department store, Ross, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, although TJ Maxx has some good, has some good jewelry for some good prices. But if my jewelry collection... If the way that I look for jewelry and the kind of jewelry I want, that it would cost a guap. It would cost a lot. And so for me, this is how I satisfy my jewelry urges is by thrifting it. And the thrift store always has, to me, the best jewelry. And so, oh, this was the last but not least. <sighs> look at this, y'all. Hold on. I don't want to take up all your time, but I want you to see how fabulous this piece is. And if I would have had this piece before my baby shower... I probably would have worn it then. Eh, how do I put this on? And when I asked to see it, the lady in the um, the lady at Goodwill was just like, "Oh my gosh, I didn't, I have not seen that before." She's like, "That was your eye that saw that." Look at that. Isn't that fabulous? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna paint my nails either white or black. And wear this. Can't go into the cookie jar with this. Everybody would know, right? Cookies. <laughs> but isn't that fabulous? And this was three ninety nine. All right. So that's it for jewelry. And then I bought a few items of clothing. One I was actually let me see. I was taking a picture of it uh, before I started the video for eBay. So this is a Trina Turk dress. Once again, who is just giving away their Trina Turk? So here we go with that. That's cute, right? Really cute dress. And then I got this for myself. I am in this whole black and white kick right now. My baby shower is black and white. Um, Riley's nursery is going to be black and white. I don't know what's going on with me in black and white, but I don't know. I need to check some psychology journals or something. Maybe it's me calming down my senses, but not really. Uh -huh. So this, oh, it actually has a price. So this was $3.99. And it's actually a 32. So it's like really, really big. It's a huge black and white. I shouldn't say huge. I apologize for anybody who's a 32 or, or above. It's huge on me. So it's a black and white blouse. And I want to wear it with some leggings and a big belt. 
So what I want is some black and white striped leggings or just some black leggings, some over the knee boots and this with a belt. That's what I'm thinking. That's where I'm headed with this. So that was $3.99. And I'll do a, a, um, a try on video for you. Now this honey, whoever gets this in my eBay store is blessed beyond measure. Cause if they would have had this in a size 18, Deion Dean would have got it. This is a cache white or off white, um, off white tuxedo. So I'll show you the pants first because they're really, really neat. So it's like a tapered leg. Flawless. And with my eBay store, I I don't just put anything in my store. I put stuff that I would wear. Or I put like business casual items in there because I know a lot of us are starting um, starting new and I like to create um, thrift boxes for my clients. And so I do have a, like a lot of suit jackets and stuff like that. I have a lot of professional wear, but then I have funky pieces like um, like this purse. <laughs> so you'll see this purse in there. And then of course, all of like the designer stuff that I find, like my MCM bag and the Marc Jacobs bag and this Kate Spade bag all in my eBay store. And so think on that very note, when I saw this, this is, so it was $7.99 for the entire suit. Baby, I want you to see this suit. I want you to see the jacket of this tuxedo. Look at the back. Bay, bay, look at that. That is so hot to me. Look at that. Yes, God. Look at the back. Can you see that? Look at the back of that suit. Oh my gosh. And it's actually brand new. I didn't realize that. I just saw it and I liked it. But it's brand new. Oh my gosh. $7.99. Ha! Huh? And look at the original price. Oh, that's going on eBay immediately, like right now. I didn't realize that was brand new. That's a hot item. Okay, so okay, so we're going a little long. So let me give you two. Oh, I have another person here. So this is a coach bag. Authentic coach. Authentic coach has all the hardware and stuff. And you can tell it's authentic by the inside and by the hang tag, but it's authentic. I don't know if you guys will see that. Forgot that was actually in there. Hmm. Okay. So I got that. And then two more items for myself. I bought this blazer once again to wear with like white tee and jeans. And I love it because it has the little Ivy League elbow cap. And this was by Joan Rivers. And this is $5.99. But I really liked it. It looked very collegiate. It looked very fall. So that'll be, that's one item. And then this, I don't know where I'm going in this, but I'm going to make it work. I tried it on and it looked good. So this will be, this is $5.99 as well. Cute blazer. For the fall. So with this, I'd probably wear like a black bodycon. I could wear any color bodycon with it. Or I'm infamous for my white tees and jeans. Or like black pants. Um, or even some shorts. And some, well, my husband won't let me wear heels. But like some shorts and some black Oxfords. I'm killing it every time. And then lastly, because fall, I love fall. And so I was like, oh, this would be cute. Some little, wear this with a pair of, um, this is $4.99 with a pair of like brown loafers for the fall in a jean jacket. Wouldn't that be cute? Yay. So this is a, a video that's longer than most because I really, I really killed it in Goodwill. Um, but, oh, I'm so hot. Ooh, okay. But I wanted to show you um, just what I put on eBay and what I have for myself as well. Um, because I am launching the eBay course as well. And so as I launch the eBay course and as I prep for Riley's arrival, I wanted to make sure that my store was stocked. And so there you go. 
I will probably be doing another haul next week. I'm going to go to another Goodwill um, in the week. I'm not quite sure. But I try to hit the thrift stores at least once a week. That's why you guys get weekly hauls from me. And no, I'm not hoarding the stuff. I'm actually selling it like a good girl. And so that's another thing. So if you are interested in my eBay course, I will leave a link below. Um, it's about an hour long, and it takes you from start to finish, where to find items, how to price your items, how to describe your items, how to sell your items, and how to ship your items. I go from start to finish. Just for all of my guys and gals out there who are thrifters, who have a bunch of stuff that, you know, we do or do not wear, let's start making some money on it. And, you know, like... You can go to the store if you find a bag like this and it's not your style, but you can, you know, you can make some money off of it, buy it and put it on eBay. Like just put it on eBay. They're, just put it on eBay. Make some money back. All right. So love you. Remember, we never pay retail. Uh, follow me on Instagram. I am, I am Dion Dean. Um, I'll leave a link to the eBay course and I will leave a link to my eBay store if you have an interest in seeing how I do what I do. All right. Love you. See you soon. Bye.